Hello everyone. So today let us take a look at this question from Jennifer asked on the community about ability to edit a subtask when uh, status changes for uh, parent task. Now Jennifer is asking here about a transition. So when the parent let us say a parent is a transition from uh, one status to another status what jennifer is trying to do and uh, asking here whether we can have that transition screen so you know the screen that we can uh, pop up when the um, when, when the transition is uh, happening or basically in between the transition between two statuses and the purpose of the transition screen is to capture some information that can be saved or edited on the issue now what jennifer is trying to understand whether this this particular thing can be done for the sub task so imagine that you know you have uh, a story and for that particular story you may have uh, two sub tasks now the moment you transition your story maybe you want to pop up the transition screen three times number 1 for the actual story number 2 for uh, you know this sub task number 1 and number 3 for sub task number 3 and uh, this is of course not possible because the way transition works transition actually happens or transition is basically for that particular issue level so if the transition is happening at the issue level it is basically going to display the screen applicable for that particular uh, issue not really for a sub task but there is a way to do it uh, if if your objective if your goal here is to update your sub task or basically copy some inf information from parent uh, or basically transfer the information or sync the issue fields then you need to use automation and i recently showed this uh, in uh, my video where i basically covered how to do it exactly how to do it so in this particular video copy fields from parent to sub task i basically discussed this particular scenario and i'll also show you my rule my um, automation rule that will give you a very good idea about how this uh, rule uh, works and uh, i mean uh, you can take a look at the video to to basically go through uh exactly how this particular rule is configured but in summary what you need to do you basically need to trigger the rule the trigger of the rule would be to uh wait for the transition so whenever our, whenever uh whenever issue is transition then run this rule and then you need to use a branch rule for sub task and uh, then for for within that particular branch for sub task you need to edit the issue fields and when you are editing the issue fields you need to specify or select your fields that can be copied from parent now this is of course uh, not really going to edit the fields at the sub task but in a way it is editing because you are using your automation rule so as long as you have those fields on the parent you can uh, copy those field values from parent to your uh, your sub task and i thought i'll probably show you uh, at least the rule because you know i've covered this uh, uh recently in one of my video so this is a rule where uh, you know we are talking about issue transition and uh, when you are uh, you are looking at the branch rule basically branch rule for sub task of that particular issue that is just being transition you can actually define here when you select the action edit issue that copy this field from parent to uh basically you know copy due date from parent copy text field from parent and so on now i i wanted to make this video because uh, the way that the thing which is different here in this particular question is about the transition screens not really about the automation i we, we all know uh, or we basically i wanted to share that now of course it can be done using automation but uh, when you are working on the transition screens transition screens work on the issue level on which that transition is happening and that is the, that is the main thing that i wanted to cover so that is all that is all i wanted to talk about in this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today thank you very much